So yeah, um, I'm American. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm not actually Japanese. So <laughs> I've been faking my nationality for about what, like, twenty-eight years, I think. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not Japanese. I'm American. So I mean, that's what everybody says, right? So here. Uh, let me talk about everybody. Uh, also, like, I found out this, like, one comment as well. Anyone else notice he scheduled this an hour later than usual? No. It's exactly the same as usual. It's exactly the same. At 12 p.m. on Sunday. It's exactly the same. <laughs> but yeah, so... What I wanted to talk about is, uh, yeah, um, I'm American, because I mean, he says I'm, Amer I'm American, and I recently uh, posted this one thing. How's your Japanese so good? Uh! And I was like, yeah, I mean, because I have a passport, and that probably explains something for you, right? So I uploaded that, I posted that, and this is what everybody said. This weeb thinks having a Japanese passport makes him Japanese! <laughs> so how long have you been photoshopping? <laughs> That's clearly photoshopped! <laughs> yeah, right. Identity theft isn't a joke, Sora! <laughs> Interestingly, there was like this one comment as well. That finger is so sexy, by the way. <laughs> The funny thing about it is, like, I actually get that sometimes. So, uh... Uh... People tell me, like, I'm ugly and I'm, I'm a weave and, like, stuff like that all the time, but when it comes down to, like, my hands, people tell me my hands are, like, so clean. So, I know I do stupid things. I know I'm a weave. I know I'm a nerd, but when it comes down to my hands, my hands are so clean, right? And there's a reason. I freaking touch myself a lot. As in, I masturbate a lot, so, like, my hands are so clean. Like, people sometimes ask me what kind of things I do to my hands, or, like, my skin, in general, because, like, I get that a lot, like, Oh my god, your skin's so clean! Oh my god, how can I get skin like yours? What the fuck?! No, I mean, I don't really do anything. I don't really use, like, any products or anything. The only thing I do is, like, seriously just touch myself. I masturbate a lot. I literally just... But yeah, thank you for the donation, Usagi bomb. I actually saw the donation like a little bit, I mean, earlier. But yeah, thank you so much for the donation. And Kate Lay, daily stream reminder to give me your PP. So uh, uh, the thing about it is uh, I've been still getting a lot of like D-picks recently too. And thank you for giving me the D-picks, everybody. But can I ask everybody about something? What am I supposed to do with the DPX? What? Yeah, I'm not real, by the way. I'm fake, uh, if you didn't know, if you didn't know. And yeah, uh, you're faking about not being Japanese. I mean, 
So let me talk about something, everybody. So this is what happened. Uh, this is like uh, I think that was like about two days ago. Uh, I was playing this one game called VR Chat, and as you guys like all know that I've been playing VR Chat to like troll some people, but. I was just casually playing VR chat by myself to just chill with some people. And I was talking to this one dude who is an American. And he asked me like where I'm from. So I said, oh, I'm Japanese. And he went like, no, you cannot be Japanese. I mean, I have Japanese friends and you don't sound nothing like them. You're faking your nationality, dude. Are you a weeb? What the fuck? And I was like, yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm a weeb. I'm not Japanese, I'm sorry. And he was like, so, where are you actually from? Where are you actually from, tell me. And I was like, I mean, I know I'm a weeb, but, um, I'm Japanese, like, really? And he was like, no, I mean, stop fucking with me like that. It's not funny at all. You're not Japanese. So I just, uh, told him to search Sura the Troll. Cause it's my YouTube channel and on the channel he can see my face he can hear my voice he can probably tell I'm Japanese because I do some Japanese stuff right so I just told him to search Sorada Troll right so he searched Sorada Troll and he just told me like so how can I confirm that this is actually you how how can I tell this is actually you dude do you do you have any proof prove it to me just watch that video, I said. Just just watch it. And you can probably tell I'm Japanese. And I'm sort of troll, like in the video. So he watched the video and he could apparently tell like I'm Japanese. And yeah, so he confirmed that I was Japanese. Like he just figured out that I was Japanese. But after that, he kept asking me like where I grew up or um, where I'm actually from. <laughs> So what he said was like, so I know your parents are Japanese, but I can tell that you didn't grow up in Japan. So what country did you grow up in? Probably like Germany, right? No. So yeah, I'm a weeb. But right, thank you for the donation, uh, Henry Ku. Carlos, thank you for the donation. Jackie Cho, White T. Hey Sora, will you bring back voice acting videos? With like Usachan and Apple Guy? Let's see. It actually takes like a lot of time and effort, but let's see. Uh, Kozu, did you see the video I made? I feel like I did. I feel like I didn't, but if you're talking about the one like where you just gathered like all the moments, I say from like A to Z. Yeah, I think I watched it. But thank you for the video, man. And Scarlet can 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 er D. Blink if you are not from Japan. Are you gay? I'm gay. And uh, so um I actually wanted to talk about this as well. So, do you guys know what the definition of Sorella Troll is? Alright, so I, I, I want you guys to tell me like what the definition of Sorella Troll is. I know like this is way too sudden, but I just wanted to make sure if everybody knows like what the definition of Sorella Troll is. Gay. I'm gay. I mean, I'm gay. Weeaboo. So, interestingly, it seems that everybody got it wrong. The answer is... So, uh, there's like this one amazing website called uh, Urban Dictionary, right? So, if you search Sorada Troll and look for a definition there on that website, this is what you see. Ready? Nerd. <laughs> Nerd. 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 No lifer. Nerd. 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 
Nerd. Nerd. When you get disowned by your own mom. <laughs> so that's the definition of Suradat Shul, if you guys didn't know. And that's actually accurate, I mean. But, so yeah, the definition of like Suradat Shul is not gay, but a nerd, so. Uh... Kushmaster 5000. Unchi, I am a weeb too. By the way, pants are needed. Uh, my pants too? Black? Actually, I don't, I'm not really sure. It might be white. It's like some black and white striped pants too. So I'm not sure. Uh, Tyrannos. You know any good places to buy dog meat? I actually know a, a, a lot of places to buy dark meat in Japan. Uh, so there's like this one place called uh, Google, and uh, if you go to like this specific place, you can basically get everything there. And what you have to do is like this this one thing called a keyboard, right? So there's like this one thing called a keyboard, and if you type dark meat on. Uh, Google, some interesting results come up so that you can just find dog meat there. So you know what I mean? So yeah, you can get some dog meat on that like one specific website called uh, Google. So try it. Hey Marcos, thank you for the donation. And uh, is it safe to go out in your area, Sora? If you were talking about the whole like uh, thing, the lockdown thing, it's actually kind of safe in my area because like nobody's that affected. I mean, nobody's- I don't really think any people have the virus in my area, but the funny thing about it is like, uh, so I actually went out the other day, like as in two days ago, because I wanted to buy some con- <laughs> I was gonna say condoms, but- I wanted to buy some coke and some uh, chocolate and stuff like that, so I went to a convenience store. But nobody was really around, like, nobody was outside. So I think everybody is just really careful. There's no lockdown, like, we are not in quarantine or anything. But, yeah, people are not outside, and... I was pretty much the only person, like, who was outside, like, two days ago, so... But it's kind of safe here. In terms of the virus. And Paolo Angelo Trini Trinidad. He reminded me of Taiko Katano. He's an actor, Kamen Rider Chaser. Some people tell me that sometimes. Like, oh my god, Sura, you look like one of those characters like that appears in Kamen Rider. Oh my god. Do I really look like one of those um people? I'm actually curious. I mean, I get that a lot. Do I? Why are you lying? If you're talking about me, like, not being Japanese, I don't know, man. It's just how it is, so. It's the hair. I mean, I don't really think the hair has anything to... So, thanks to the hair I have, a lot of people think that I'm gay, right? A lot of people think that I'm a weeb because I look like an anime character and nobody really looks like this in Japan. And this one, like, white guy, aka me, is trying to be Asian so hard that this one white guy is trying to get some anime hair to make himself look like he's, on, he's Japanese, right? So... Why are you gay? Because... I like Donald Trump. I think he's hot. If you don't know like what I'm talking about, search Surada Troll Donald Trump and you can find this like one fan fiction where I make out with Donald Trump. Like I kiss him in the fan fiction. And Donald Trump. Yeah. Uh, 
filtered Roku, please that say L in Japanese. L L in Japanese L L Thank you for the donation. Uh he's a gamer daddy. Marcos, thank you for the donation. So uh as I kinda mentioned, uh my hands are so clean, right? And this is like the only thing that I'm kinda proud of. Like people tell me I'm ugly and I'm a weave like all the time, but when it comes down down to my hands, my hands are so freaking clean. Like that's the only thing I'm proud of actually, when it comes down to like myself. So people think that I take care of my hands all the time. People around me in Japan, I mean, they think I take care of my hands all the time so that they think I'm gay. I mean, I'm gay, so. Are you vibing? No, I'm just being gay. Is Japan in lockdown? No. <laughs> uh, Fei Long Red, do you like the funny yellow dog meme? I don't know what that is, but what is it about? Uh, Tyrannos, I'm now wanted for animal abuse. Thanks for your advice. Thank you for the donation. Uh, Martin H. Sora say happiness without the ha part. Penis. I mean, you can just make me say penis like straight up. Like, hey, Sora say penis. Hey, Sora say penis. Uh. Oh, by the way, if you guys like actually want me to say like penis or vagina or something, I mean, I will say it for you. If you want me to say, it. are you straight? What is the definition of like being straight? Because I mean, so here, the thing about it. Let me talk. Let me talk about something really interesting. So, on this channel, on this channel though, I've been saying I masturbate to Nicki Minaj a lot. I masturbate to big boobs. I masturbate to like milfs. I masturbate to anything, right? And. I've been saying, oh yeah, I like big boobs, but still, some people tell me that I'm gay. So what is the de definition of like straight? Tell me. So, are you a socialist? I don't know. What do you think? Uh, how do you say, uh, hang me, hang me with your pantyhose in Japanese? One more time. Boku no chin chin shigoite. Boku no chin chin shigoite. And by the way, I'm not Japanese, I'm a weeb, so uh, there might be some grammatical mistakes and I might be saying it wrong. But you know, I'm a weeb. I'm just trying to learn Japanese, like really hard, because, you know. Uh, creeper static, why are you wanted in my area? Wanna meet? Wanna meet? Gay? FF? What is FF? What does FF mean? FINAL FUCK! That means final fuck! Doesn't it? Yeah, that means final fuck! We can, yeah, we can do that, we can final fuck, damn! Right? Wait, am I- am I getting it wrong? I don't know, like, what the fuck am I doing, Abe? Why do I feel like that doesn't mean that? You mean this one? No, it means this. I think. But again, uh, so here, here's the thing. Uh, I want you guys to look at the title of this stream. So, I've been faking my national nationality, right? I'm not Japanese. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry, but I'm not Japanese. Like, I've been my faking- I've been faking my nationality, right? And uh, the truth is, as somebody said earlier, I'm American, right? And, uh, not this one. Uh, 
I mean, I have a passport. I have a Japanese passport, but、uh, you know, I'm a weeb that thinks having a Japanese passport makes me Japanese. So I'm a weeb. So that I don't really know a lot of Japanese that much. So that like I just don't know how to really say this in Japanese. But this is、uh, what I think how Japanese say this in Japanese. Thank you. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. So,、uh, Otaku Trash, thank you for the donation. Have you tasted your own cum before?、Uh, let's get serious, everybody. So, as I've been saying, I touch myself a lot, right? I touch myself a lot. Like, I masturbate. I mean, I'm kind of serious about this. Like, when I'm, kind of, when I'm talking about this, when I'm talking about stuff like this, I'm usually serious. So,、uh, let me explain. Have I tasted my own cum before? So, the short answer is obviously no. Because, I mean, I know that people think I'm gay, but I'm not gay for myself. You know what I mean? I'm gay. People think I'm gay, so I'm gay. And I've never done it with any guys in my entire life, but you know, everybody thinks I'm gay, so I'm gay. So, I've never tasted my own cum, but I've been curious like, what it tastes like, right? So I googled it once before. That was when I was、uh, 11, 12, something like that. I just remember I googled it. Like, it was not Google, it was actually Yahoo, because Yahoo was freaking the biggest thing, like, when I was 12, like 13. So, I searched it on the internet, and apparently, cum in general tastes like. It tastes like raw egg with something. Salt? I don't think so. I don't think it tastes like salt. No, I don't think so. And this is not like, I'm not talking, I'm not talking from my experience. I'm just talking from like what I read on the internet. So I don't know what I'm trying to say anymore. But and yeah,、uh, actually, I talked about this with one of the YouTubers, one of the girl YouTubers. Do you guys know like, who I'm talking about? I feel like I have to kind of avoid saying her name here because I don't really want to like, damage her career by just saying this. But I talked about this with like, this one female <laughs> YouTuber. <laughs> And she told me exactly the same thing. Like, it kind of tastes like raw egg or something. <laughs> I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna say like who the YouTuber I'm talking about is, but yeah, I mean, you know, just say it. <laughs> but thank you for the donation. And、uh, Filtered Rocco, okay, before I sleep, say my username in Japanese. I honestly don't know how to say that in Japanese. I mean, I'm a weeb, but I.、Uh... Well, let me actually try. I'm curious like, how to say that in Japanese. Filtered Roko, right? What is Roko in Japanese? It, so it's a, it's a noun, so I don't really think it can be translated into Japanese. It can be just Roko. Filtered? What is filtered in Japanese? I mean, I'm a weeb, but、I'm, I just really don't know how to say filtered in Japanese. Filtered. What is filtered in Japanese? Hey, wait, uh, I think it will be something like. It should be something like this, uh. Use Google Translate? Sure. Let's use Google Translate and let's see what happens. Here, everybody. Ready? And that's why you shouldn't trust Google Translate. Thank you. That was freaking like the best demonstration ever, actually. So, filtered. If you wanted to say filtered, I think it would be something like, what is it? Like, 
I don't really know. I don't really think. I don't really think we say. I don't really think Japanese people say filtered. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's just filtered roko. I think. I'm. I'm not really sure. Like how to say that really. Um, and that boy. Thank you for the donation. Haha, <laughs> pathetic loser. Nice tongue, by the way. Yum. The fuck are you talking about? Yeah, I mean, I kind of flashed my penis like earlier in this stream, so. Did you guys see my penis? No. I know I quit teacher. I quit teacher, so I'm not getting like any money from uh, the school actually anymore. So, and royalty freak, are you a kumu? I don't know what a kumu is. Is it like when you come a lot? If so, yes. I don't actually know like what that is. Why are you using my passport photo? If you are talking about this one, you know what, everybody. Give me a little bit. So people think that it's it's photoshopped, right? So here. You know what I have in my hand? Yeah, yeah, of course. This stream is edited. This stream is edited. Because with the modern technology, it's possible, right? Yeah, this stream is edited. Yeah, this stream is edited. Like, not, nothing about this stream is real. So my face is, like, kind of fake, too. I photoshopped, like, this face so hard that I made it look like I'm Asian. But in reality, I'm not Asian. I'm just a weeb. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm not gonna fake my nationality anymore. I'm gonna just fuck my ass. And yeah, so... Besides that, there's like one thing I kinda wanted to ask you guys, so uh... I don't know like where you guys are from, but... Can you guys like go outside now or like do you guys have to stay at home like freaking 24 7 is it what's happening oh are there any people who can go outside because in japan i mean I'm not really in Japan, cause you know, as somebody said earlier, I'm American. I I I I'm in America, but in Japan, uh, we can they can still uh, go outside. We can in Brazil. Oh, you get you will get arrested. Yeah, that's like how it is in uh you in the UK, right? That's what I heard. Yeah, like in a lot of like European countries. I can go outside. Oh, okay. Kinky Hijoji Tai Senge de 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 So yeah, that's like how it is. So, uh... Japan has declared the state of emergency or like whatever it's called. So, uh, the government can't force us to stay at home. But still, we can go outside. So, this is what I did the other day. I kind of... Tried to... Buy... Some... Never mind, I'm not gonna talk about this. I'm gonna get reported. How tall are you? 468 centimeters tall, I think? In imperial scale, it's like... 5.6 feet, I think? In America, some places you can go to, but... 
If you go to eat, you have to stay in your car, and then you drive to the place. And then! And they give you your food, but you can't go to a lot of places, and school's closed. That's what I thought too, that's what I heard, I mean, so... As somebody said earlier, I'm American, so I mean, I'm in America right now, but that's what I heard too, from somebody. Um, so, let me kind of talk about like how it's like in Japan right now, cause what the f- I mean, so, here. Some people say that like my reactions are fake when I get like freaking like, huge donations. Like this. <laughs> I mean, like, how can it be fake though? Like, seriously, I mean... Think about it, think about it. It's just... See it this way. You were just casually chilling like this, and you just... I was like doing stuff like that in my previous stream and somebody told me like I have ADHD but interestingly I don't have it I don't know man but yeah thank you thank you for the donation Josh I'm sad lately Sora because of because of the quarantine can you sing me a song to cheer me up also shout out to my homie uh, his birthday is tomorrow on 420. Thank you. So let me actually sing you a song here. So uh what do you guys want me to sing? Like Josh Strife, what do you want me to sing? But I know the best song for you. I know the best song for you. I know the best song for you. I know the best song for you about having sex during during quarantine. This song is called. I, I I'm pretty sure like everybody knows what this song is called. But... I wanna see you burn Show me your penis, penis I wanna see your penis, penis Show me your penis, penis I wanna see your penis, penis Show me The thing about it is, like, I'm singing this, right? And, uh, my neighbors can literally hear me saying penis, penis. And here, so I don't think they speak English, so I don't think they know what I'm saying. But here, let me just do one more thing for my neighbors.
Fuck my ass! I don't really think they know any English so that I can do stuff like this. But if they know like any English, I'm fucked. They think I'm gay. Sora's big fangirl. Sperm can be sold for like three hundred dollars. That's good money, Papa. I'm jealous. I mean, can I really do it? Like, I want to do it, but I don't really think they want my sperm. I mean, like, who wants like this weeb, weeb, nerds sperm? I don't really think、uh, they want to like any sperm from me. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for telling me stuff like that. That actually made me really happy. And fifty one fifty hold. Can you say your whole? I have my own music album for free forever outro in your really nerdy voice. I actually forgot like what I say at the end of my videos, but as far as I remember, I say for free forever, right? <laughs> I have my own music album for free <laughs> forever. <laughs> By the way, I never watched the ending part, like the outro myself. I never watch it, cause I mean, like, let me talk about something really interesting about like that part. So, from my,、uh, so like for creators, like there's like this one. I would say function for YouTubers, like there's like this one page. Where you can check how long people have been watching your channel, like your videos, and you can check like when people click off from your video and stuff like that. The interesting about that is like, ninety-five percent of the people who watch my videos usually click off when that one thing starts playing for free forever, and people usually just click off. Boom. And they watch Justin Bieber. I mean, everybody loves Justin Bieber, including myself. So I mean, Justin Bieber is really amazing too. Bucket made of teeth. Sora gets kicked out for noise complaint live. I don't really think that can happen, cause I don't really think that can happen, honestly. If that happens, I'm gonna freaking make a video out of it and just fuck my ass. Kappa emote. That song compelled me as a human being. Let me just do that again for you. So here, I.、Uh, do you follow the motto "ejaculate then evacuate"? I do, but、uh, thank you for the donation. So here,、uh, I kind of really want to get into trouble with my neighbors. So here. I'm gay for my neighbor. I'm gay for my neighbors. Please fuck my ass. I am corny. My dick is cut. Fuck my ass. <laughs> I don't really think、uh, they know like what I'm saying in Jap, I mean in English. So I think I can just like do that for twenty hours like straight up. But I'm not gonna do that because I mean, why? I like potato. I'm poor, but still, be my roommate, please. If I can, yeah, I would be like to be your roommate. But I don't really think I should. Do you think I should be your roommate? Cause think about it here. This is the so this is this is how it probably goes. Like if I actually become your roommate, I suddenly shout "fuck my ass," right? I suddenly sing songs like that, like "fuck my ass, fuck my ass," right? Would you be fine with it? If so, yeah. I guess I can be your roommate. 
and the Harem King. How are black men treated in Japan? I mean, so... I feel like I have to be serious about this, so let me just uh, forget about like freaking trolling or anything. I, let me just be serious about like this one thing. So here, uh, how are black men treated in Japan? They are just treated like foreigners. That's one thing. They are treated like foreigners. And uh, some people ask me like, then how about white people? They are also treated like foreigners. Cause they they are in fact not Japanese, right? So they are treated differently. But it's not because Japanese people are racist or anything. It's just because Japanese people treat non-Japanese people differently. Cause I mean, Japan is like based- So if you come to Japan, you will like soon notice that everybody is Asian in Japan, right? So we are not used to seeing like foreigners, non-Asians in Japan. So we tend to stare at like non-Japanese people a lot. We freaking- so let's say you're black or like you're white. We freaking stare at you like- He's a foreigner. He's a foreigner. <laughs> like that's literally what happens if you're like not Asian. But if you were Asian, that doesn't happen. So if you are Asian, this is what happens. If you are white, this is what happens. <laughs> if you are black, this is what happens. And yeah, if there are any Japanese people, like if there are any people living in Japan, I'm pretty sure like you can, you can just vouch this. Like this is pretty much what happens in Japan, right? So people ask me all the time like, hey, are Japanese people racist towards like some own race? We are actually, we are kind of racist towards Asian people, to be honest, to be fair. If I have to be really serious about the whole thing Japanese people are 100% racist towards Japanese people or Asians in general I think but from my experience I don't really think uh, Japanese people treat like black people or white people like that bad I think of course Japanese people are not used to seeing foreigners so that they treat you different differently. They just go like, as I just explain, they usually go like, Oh my god, you're a foreigner! You're not Japanese! You're white! I'm sorry! I'm sorry I don't speak English! I'm sorry! That's literally what happens, really. I'm not even like exaggerating this. Are there any Japanese people? If so, that's really what it is, right? People, so Japanese people freaking like, yeah, they, they just kind of go like, Oh my god, are you really, are you really from a foreign country? Fuck, I wanna fuck my ass. They don't say I wanna fuck my ass, right? But um, they kind of treat you like that. Are foreigners popular in school then? Yeah, non-Japanese people are freaking popular as hell. It's insane. It's really insane. So back in university, uh, the most popular guy ever was like, he was freaking Filipino, actually. It was not because he was Filipino, but it was just because he was fr freaking good looking. But in general, in Japan, though, foreigners freaking get popular. It's insane. I've never seen any non-Japanese people that visited Japan who didn't get any girlfriends or like boyfriends all of them got boyfriends or like girlfriends or they fucked somebody in japan like that's literally how it has been like from my experience so but yeah that's how it is really yes really seriously so here this is what they say this is what japanese people say in japan I want to marry a foreigner. 
I want to marry a foreigner, and I want and I want a Hafu kid. If you guys don't know what Hafu is, it's like a mixed Japanese person, basically. Hafu. I want to have a Hafu kid. I really want a foreigner to fuck my vagina. Please. I want to have a foreigner baby. Seriously, I'm not even exaggerating this. If you think I'm joking about this, I'm actually 100% serious. And see, this guy is Japanese, and yeah, he's been watching my channel for a while now. I've been reading comments, and he usually shows up like in my videos, and and he says like, yeah, I mean, there are girls like that in Japan. See, he vouched it. Seriously, it's a thing in Japan. Being a foreigner in Japan freaking gives you like gets you like 1,000 girlfriends. I'm not even joking about this. But the thing about it is, think about it is, so this is what I've been saying. I've been saying I love weeaboos. I've been saying weeaboos are loved in Japan, right? Do you guys now get the reason? Weeaboos are foreigners. They love Japan. They love Japanese culture. Well, they want to be Japanese and whatever. What happens if those people come to Japan? Do you know what happens? They freaking get popular because Japanese people usually go like, Oh my god, he's a foreigner! He likes Japan! Oh my god, fuck my ass! Ah! That's what happens. So... This is why my average looking friends were top tier over there. Yes! That's what I've been saying. So let me talk about this one story. So let me talk about this story of an American guy who came to Japan and got freaking like three girlfriends. I've, I've been talking about it in like my previous streams a lot of times, but I think it's important to talk about it. So here, there's this guy called, uh, I'm gonna just call him uh, Jess. I'm gonna just call him Jess. It's not like what his name is, but Jess came to Japan about six years ago, I think. And he's been in Japan like for three years now, I think. He, he, he went back to America at some point before, but... So he came to Japan about six years ago. He looked like a typical American nerd that didn't have any friends. He came to Japan. I became friends with him because I like to be friends with like a lot of people. He came to Japan and he became he became friends with me, and I'm a weeb, right? He was a weeb too. He likes anime. He likes Japanese games. He spoke Japanese like a weeb, like oh, oh that's so. That's literally how he sounded like. But there's nothing wrong with it, by the way. And uh, he was so unconfident about himself because he didn't really have a lot of friends in America. He have never he has never had a girlfriend in his entire life. He came to Japan. You know what happened? A lot of girls went up to him. And the girls told him that they wanted to be friends with him. And then after that, my friend, Jess, fucked those three girls. And he... I think he's had like three girlfriends in Japan. So he lost his virginity in Japan. His first girlfriend was Japanese. He's going to stay here forever. True story. And see, I'm not surprised, especially if you hang out at the pub in Shibuya or the one near Takeshita Dori. Yeah, so I'm not even exaggerating this. Like, if you are in Japan, or like if you're Japanese, or if you have any experience in Japan, then yeah, I mean, you can tell how I'm not trolling, right? I'm not actually depressed about this. I'm actually happy that like they can have a happier life in Japan. I, I mean, that's great, right? 
that's great! Like how Japan, the country, is the place that can make people even happier. I'm actually happy about it. Like, I'm not even mad. Like, I'm actually happy that my friend just got a girlfriend in Japan and he's now settled down in Japan as well. I'm really happy about it, so. Uh, and that boy, Ken Kamishimashou Ken Naibu no Kono Oshiri. Ken Kamimashou Ken Naibu no Kono Oshiri. What the fuck? Well, thank you for the donation. Uh, Katshin, I think your neighbors will catch on to what you say eventually. But I don't really think anything will happen though, because what's wrong with fuck my ass? Because I want them to fuck my ass, right? And I'm not saying like, I'm going to fuck your ass, because if I say that, that's like a threat, so they can report me for that. But I'm asking them to fuck my ass. So I don't really think uh, there's anything wrong with it, so. And uh, Sun Trevor, if you American gaijin hunters will come for you, and this is what I've been saying, like seriously, so. There's like this one type of specific people called uh, gaijin hunters. It's English. It's, it's an English word. So we Japanese people don't say that. Don't say gaijin hunters. But uh, yeah, there are so many gaijin hunters. And gaijin means foreigners, by the way. And they freaking... It's not like they are trying to hunt you down. What they do is they want you to fuck their vag or their penis. I'm not even exaggerating this. I'm like actually dead serious about this. Like, so, yeah. If you're American, you'll be freaking popular in Japan. Like seriously. But again, if you're Asian, it can be kind of hard for you to be popular in Japan. Because you know what? So, it will be really hard for you to be popular in Japan if you're Asian. Because we are Japanese. We are used to seeing Asian people. Like, we are all Japanese. So we are used to seeing Asians. So we, we will not be like, oh my god! You are you are a foreigner? Oh my god! We will not be like that if you are Asian. Cause I'm Japanese. We are Japanese. I mean I'm a weeb, but so you have to be non-Asian to be popular in Japan. That's one thing. But there's an exception. There's an exception. So I just said Asians can't be popular in Japan. Right. But there's an exception, because I experienced it myself when I was back in university. Let me explain. So Asians, there's still hope to be popular with Japanese girls in Japan. This is what you do. Speak English. Speak English to them. And act like... Like uh, some Hollywood stars. This is what you do. That will get you like freaking 1,000 girlfriends, like boyfriends. Am I trolling? No! I'm serious, because I experienced it myself. So, I mean, I'm a nerd. As you can see, this one, not this one, but here. I'm a nerd, I'm a no-lifer. Uh, I'm a nerd, right? So everybody knows I'm a nerd. But in reality, I actually was kind of a little bit popular back in university just because I speak English just because I've been speaking English and Japanese both so a lot of people came up to me I still like remember that I, I a lot of people came up to me and told me like hey how did you learn English oh my god you speak English do you have like any American friends do you have any Australian friends oh my god you speak English hey how do how do I say this phrase in English oh my god fuck my badge that happens to me when did you first learn English I kind of grew up speaking English and Japanese both, so I mean, but I just re I, I remember the the first time I spoke English ever was like when I was seven or like eight or something. I forgot. I don't know, man.
But yeah, I mean, that happens to me too. So a nerd like me can be popular with some girls just because I speak English, right? Of course you can be popular if you come to Japan because everybody speaks English like recently, especially if you are not Japanese. If you are Japanese, then you can't speak Japanese because like that's what everybody thinks and that's why everybody thinks I'm a weeb. Because I'm, I think I'm Japanese, right? But I speak English so that everybody goes like, Oh no, Japanese people don't speak English, dude. Why you speak English? Are you a weeb? Are you from Germany or something? Yes, I'm German. <laughs> and Tiana Tarango, when you make videos, do you plan what to say or do you say whatever comes to mind? I want to make videos, but think too hard on how to make dialogue interesting. Dialogue interesting or funny. Uh, here's what everybody does. So this is not just only I do, but this is what everybody does. I'm pretty sure everybody has some, some everybody has some kind of like a scripts. 90% of the time. They have scripts, like scripts all written down. It's either they write down some ideas or they literally write down everything they are going to say. In my case, I just write down some ideas. Well, sometimes I just write down what I say. So, especially when it comes down to playing that weeb character, I write down everything I say. Because I want to make sure. Again, let me explain. This is what happens if you're a non-Japanese person coming to Japan. Oh my god! Are you a foreigner? Oh my god! I don't speak English! Oh my I think I've done this like more than three times so far. <laughs> so again, I don't really think I have to do that again. But I think that will just explain everything about what it's like. I don't understand. Okay, so let me just do that again. This is what happens when Japanese people talk to Japanese people. You ready? Hello. Oh, hello. Are you Japanese? Yeah, I am Japanese. Oh, nice to meet you. Oh, nice to meet you too. This is what happens when you're black talking to Japanese people. Hey, what's up, bro? <laughs> oh my god, are you, are you a foreigner? Do you speak English? Oh my god. <laughs> wait, are, are you okay, bro? No, <laughs> are you a foreigner? Oh, wait, how long have you been in Japan? Oh my god. I'm not even like exaggerating this, like seriously, this is what happens. This is seriously what happens. Okay, so do I have to do that again? Okay, then I'm gonna do that one more time. Hey mate, have you got a glass of coffee? I don't really think British people say that, but... Hey, hey mate, have you got a glass of tea? I don't really think that... People say that either, but... Oh my god, are you British? <laughs> A little bit, yeah. I mean, I don't really... Honestly, yeah. Let's, let's get serious. Of course. People never go like, Oh my god! That never happens. But still. What Japanese people do is close to that. If you are curious, like if I'm really exagger exaggerating about the whole story or not, go ask that to any people who lived in Japan or who are Japanese. Yes. <laughs> Asuna Yuki, do Japanese guys like blonde hair and blue eyes, blue eye girls? Uh, they do, they do, they do, they do. Again, Japanese people like freaking foreigners. Like they, they, they have a thing for non-Japanese people, non-Asians. They freaking want to fuck a non-Japanese girl, like a non-Japanese guy, at some point in their life. Like that's li literally how it is. Like that's how how literally it has been 
from my perspective as a Japanese guy. Again, I'm a weeb, I'm a weeb, but. Edward Bortman, uh, 16. You are the best. Unchi good. Thank you for the donation and thank you for that as well. Josh Strife, I could relate to your friend's story. I once almost got arrested because my ex -girl girlfriend was Japanese and she had a foreigner. Raipu. Raipu. You mean like rapu? Like rape? Fetish? It also didn't help that the police found her and her friend all tied up when the police came. Damn. Damn. D do I have to do the same thing again? D do I have to do the same thing again? I'm actually sweating a little bit because I did it like four times so far? Five times? I forgot. No? Okay. That boy. Me again. Please give me cute Japanese girl Instagram. I don't know. I mean, I don't really have any, uh, I don't really know any cute Japanese girls. So, but yeah. Thank you for the donation. 5150 hold. Your Japanese fans speak Japanese, but do they understand what you say in English? Since you mainly speak English on this channel. So, uh, thankfully, I've been getting a lot of new Japanese uh, fans actually on this channel. I've I've been reading like every comment, and I noticed that uh, there has been like more Japanese people on this channel, and there has been like a lot of people who've been giving me comments. Like, see, like uh, this one person, he or she said. Uh, yeah, I, I know English, and I like Sora, and thank you so much for telling me that, and he or she is Japanese. Right? So there are a lot of Japanese people, like, uh, than before. There are more Japanese people than before. And, uh, it's kind of interesting because, like, so some of them, like, tell me, So what did you say at this part specifically, Papa? So, how do I say this in English? Would you please tell me? So. It seems that they are studying English so that they watch my channel or they just want to see this like one Japanese guy just fucking with everybody. So I don't really know but there are like more Japanese people. I don't know like why they watch my channel. They probably just like are trying to learn Japanese or just want to see me doing stupid stuff as a Japanese person but I'm not sure. So uh, Mr. Funny Weasel, thank you for the donation. <laughs> but yeah, so, um, they usually leave, leave, like, some comments in Japanese. They never leave comments in English, so that, like, that's how I figure out, like, when somebody's Japanese. But yeah, I mean, I don't know what the fuck I'm saying anymore. Why do Japanese people get, get nervous when confronted by an English-speaking person? In Japan, people think being able to speak English means equals you are so smart. The definition of smart in Japan is when you speak English and Japanese. So, if you speak English, then people will think second language. But no, honestly though, being able to speak English has nothing to do with like smartness, like at all from my experience. You can kind of tell from me though. <coughs> honestly, it seriously has nothing to do with your smartness. I've met a lot of Japanese people who speak English and Japanese both languages, but their grades are kind of bad. So, and I speak Japanese and English both, and I can tell I'm not smart, I'm dumb. I'm more of a dumb person, like 100 person. I'm not gonna call myself a smart person, I'm dumb. So, speaking, being able to speak English and Japanese has nothing to do with being smart, but in Japan, there's a big relationship between like being able to speak English and being able to speak Japanese both languages and being smart. So 
People freak out super hard when an English speaking person comes up to Japanese people just because, in fact, Japanese people don't really speak English, right? They don't really speak English. The way how they speak English is like, Hello, nice to meet you, fuck my ass. Like, that's how Japanese people speak English, right? So, when an English speaking person comes up to a Japanese person, they usually go like, <laughs> and they don't like that. They don't like to think that they are not smart. They want everybody to think that they are smart. So that's why they freak out. Are you smart? No, I'm not smart. Like, I'm not a, I'm not even like trying to be humble or anything. I'm just trying to be just straight up honest about who I am. So they always say fuck my ass sometimes. So. That's like one thing、uh, people say a lot in Japan as well. So,、uh, Mr. Funny Weasel, thank you for the donation. Tiana Tarango, ever thought of Japanese subtitles on your videos for your Japanese viewers? I've never thought about doing that. I mean, I've thought about doing that, but I'm not gonna do it just because doing that takes a lot of time. It takes like more than. So, this is how it works, right? I make a video in English. And I translate the video into English. And this process freaking takes like more than three hours, by the way. And I have to type everything down. And I have to edit the texts as well. And this whole process like takes more than four hours. So. Voice actors. So, of course, they speak Japanese and they don't speak English because they are Japanese, right? So, they sound weird. Thank you. Usagi Bomb, Sora, I'm at work, but hearing you on my earmugs, you should do a video about that foreigner and how Japanese girls act toward them. I don't know, like, I don't really want to make a video about him because I don't really want to make fun of him. Because, I mean, he got happy in Japan, right? He got happier in Japan because, I mean, everybody in Japan likes him. And I don't really want to make fun of him, like, that way. I kind of just talked about it, about him in this stream just because I kind of thought it's, it was important to talk about him. But I don't know, I don't really want to make fun of him, like, Yeah, do any videos about him because I don't really think he wants me to talk about it on my channel. So that's why I used a、uh, you know, different name for him. Like his name is not actually Jess, but I called him Jess. Because, yeah. And Saito Senpai, thank you for the donation. Have you ever visited or have you vis ever visited a brothel or pay for sexy fun time with hostesses? I've never done that. Should I do that? Yes. What do you mean? But yeah,、uh, I'll think about this as I don't really know if I should do it or not. And I've never done it in my entire life. And I don't really think I want to do it, honestly. So let me get a little bit serious about this. I've had only one girlfriend in my entire life. And、uh, what the fuck?
Sorry, I was taking a piss. But thank you for the donation. I really appreciate it, Saito Senpai. And uh, so, what was I talking about? So, I've only had a one girlfriend in my entire life, and that was like when I was 21. And I've never dated anybody else. And I've never done it with anybody else. I've never had one night stand. Like, I don't know, like, people even do that anymore, but I've never done it in my entire life. The reason is kind of simple. I just want to take responsibility when it comes down to like girl stuff. So I don't really want to go to a place like this or do stuff like this. Because I have to be responsible for doing stuff like that, right? So, never mind. Penis. And Donald Holden, I have a very short story to support your claims, but I can fit it this super chat. It, it's less than 400 characters. Let's just read this, everybody. I hope it's not like freaking something scary. It's actually something legit! Everybody, let's read this! Alright, so... here. When I was visiting Japan, I was in the game store buying Hatsune Miku, Project Diva, and the saleswoman spent about 10 minutes trying to speak desperately trying desperately to figure out how to explain that it didn't include the instruction manual. She felt so horrible and embarrassed that she couldn't speak English. That it just made me feel bad and awkward that I couldn't speak Japanese, in Japanese instead. Also, the girl thought I was cute, so we fucked later <laughs> I mean that's really what happens though Japanese people think it's cute when foreigners can't or like don't speak Japanese they usually go like oh my god <laughs> You don't speak Japanese, it's cute. I can teach you Japanese. Say unchi, it means poop. <sighs> but yeah, so. The fuck am I doing anymore? Pre Mado. Ah, I'm late. Thank you for the donation. So, uh. Damn, it's 112 already. I really have to go. I've got things to do. What the hell? Alright, so everybody, thank, thank you for coming to my stream. It's like freaking uh, 1 12 p.m. And I really have to go. So before I go, let me just read all the comments and try to just answer all the comments for like 10 minutes. 5 minutes. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, I'll think about it. Not really. I'll think about it. Yeah, again, not really. Yes, sometimes. I recently started playing Fortnite because my friend asked me if I wanted to play it with him. Really fluent. If you want to work for a Japanese company, you have to be super fluent. Yes. Thank you for the donation. Yeah. Make Japanese friends. Yes. Uh, Weeb is an English word. Otaku is a Japanese word. So they are two different things in the first place. I don't know. I mean, I think it it's it, it really depends on like what Japanese person you are talking to. 
Nice. That works too. I mean, you can you can still be fat and you can still make friends. Uh, I don't know. I don't really know a lot of uh, cosplayers, so. Yes, and thank you for the donation, Gloria. Ja ja Jore Kui. I think it's easy. Jinjin -jin Daisuki, still sick. Thank you for the donation. What is cute in Japanese? Kawaii. Notice me. Yeah, I mean, they can be popular too. Yeah, I, I think it's just more about what kind of person you are than your nationality itself. And Clinton, thank you for your donation. I hope you have a great day, and I wish all the best. Wish you all the best in your life, Matane. Thank you for a donation as well, and I hope you have a great day as well. And thank you so much for the donation, and thank you so much for coming to my stream. Every stream, uh, Clinton, I really appreciate it. Love you, dude. Peace. Love you too. Uh, Turkish people. I know Turkish people love Japanese people because of like uh, what happened before in Tur was it like in Turkey or like in Japan I forgot but like I know that Turkish people love Japan and uh, I know like that one thing happened in Turkey before so but I don't really know like what Japanese people think about Turkish people beat me no <sighs> probably. Again, I think it depends on the person. I mean, so the trains in Japan Japan are really crowded, so people just try to touch your bat, like suddenly, randomly. Sometimes. But I've never seen it happen. Let me peg you. You can. You can fuck my ass. My poop red. I don't know. I don't know. Uh... I don't think that will ever happen. Mm, probably. Uh, be my boyfriend. That's what you have to say. I think so, yeah. I mean, Japanese people have a thing for Americans, like American culture. They are crazy about Americans. I will just let them fuck my ass. I uh, nope. The fuck! Thank you for the donation, uh, Sailor Moon. Sora, I want to have a baby with you. <laughs> Thank you for telling me that. Or you could have just said, uh, oh, I want to have sex with you. I mean...
Every night in my dreams I touch myself to you I feel you That is how I know you Fuck my ass Fly across the distance And spaces between us And you have come to show you Go on Near and far Wherever you are Fuck my ass I want your dick in my ass Once more You fuck my ass Right here in my asshole I'm horny Please fuck my ass the fuck is happening anymore? <laughs> but yeah, thank you for the donation Sailor Moon. I won't have a baby with you. Love you too. You can just just made me say it, but yeah, I won't have a baby with you. Love you too. <laughs> Primato, I legit sp spilled boiling water all over my stove because of your scream fuck my ass fuck my ass spooky meow jesus what the fuck did i come in on Nothing. I just want to fuck my ass. Flame Monkey 96. Hi Sora, what is your favorite non-Japanese movie, TV show, book? School of Rock. I don't watch TV shows. My favorite book is called uh this one. I really have to fuck myself later. I'm horny. But here, let me show you like what my favorite book is. It's not porn. Where is it? I can't find it. I can't find it. Uh, where did it go? Oh, I found it. So here, it's called... Uh, it's called... Uh, yes! 50 scientifically proven ways to be persuasive. Written by Noah J. Goldstein. I, I read some books about psychology a lot, so... And Josh Strife, here, just wanted to put this so banner says and I donated it for 2069. Thank you so much for the donation. I really appreciate it. And again, I really have to go. I've got things to do. I've got some, like, voiceover works to do. Before that, let me sing this song for you, Josh Strife. You ready? Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces fast. Bound. Steering black liquids, making my way, making my way through the crowd. And I need you, and I miss you, <laughs> and I miss you, and how I wonder if I could fall into the sky. 
sky Do you think time would pass me by? Cause you know I'd walk a thousand miles If I could just see you To fuck my ass Fuck my ass right now! So, I really have to go. So, thank you for coming to the stream, everybody. You can clip it, you can freaking repost it if you wanted to. <laughs> but I really have things to do, so see you, everybody. Have a good day. I will upload something really interesting on Tuesday. This next video is going to be really interesting. So I will see you guys on Tuesday. Not in a stream, but like I will upload something. So see ya. Take care.